Good morning. Um, this is vlog day three. It is currently 5.53 in the morning and I can't sleep. So I guess I'm just gonna start vlogging. Um, I try to go to sleep at 11 or 12. Got up at four. I've been up ever since, so I don't really think there's much luck on me going back to sleep, but we shall see. Hello, so it is currently 8.25. Um, I spent three hours working on that intro, and I shouldn't have spent three hours. <laughs> three hours making it but i did and i like it so that's all that matters um but chandler and i are about to go get groceries from kroger and then um i guess i'm gonna unpack the groceries and you're gonna unpack them with me we ended up driving all the way to kroger and we got there around 8.30 and the pickup wasn't until 9 and I did not feel like sitting in the parking lot. So I drove all the way back home and Chandler drove all the way back to Kroger because I was not going to sit there. No, <laughs> not me. But um, yeah, so he's getting the groceries and I think I'm going to take a nap because I've been up since 4 in the morning and it is now eight in the morning and I am pooped. So, good night, see you in a bit. Hello, so it is 12.30. Um, I woke up about 30 minutes ago, um, but I need to get some stuff done. I do, I need to get stuff done today before I go into work. Um, for starters, the apartment is a wreck and, um, that needs to be cleaned. So you're going to watch me clean the apartment and then I have to shower and get ready for work, which I work at 4.30. So that means I have to shower around 2.30, get out the shower around 3, do my makeup and then leave by four to get there at 4.25 to work at 4.30. <laughs> so that should be fun, but yeah. So I feel like I need to talk about a serious topic. Um, and that topic is depression. I know I, I am saying that I'm going to clean my apartment and I'm going to go to work and I'm going to do this and plans keep changing but um, that is because I am struggling really bad with depression due to my current circumstances, I no longer have a family home. Um, and that is hard on me. Um, you know, you grow up somewhere and you truly believe that that home will forever until the day you die be your childhood home. But for me, it wasn't like that. It never really felt like my home. Um, the people never made me feel like I was at home. But 
that final step to let all of that go is a big step for me. Because my whole life, I let people walk on me. I'm a nice person. I do nice things for people. I will obey to what you say if you ask me to do something or if you tell me to do something. But as I've grown older, I have realized that I can't do that anymore. I'm an adult. I need to make my own decisions and I need to be on my own. And for me to do that, unfortunately, I need to let go of some people. Even though I don't want to do that, in the back of my head, I don't want to do that. But at the same time, my heart is telling me to run. Pack my bags and run as far as I can because something is out there. For me and I'm going to find what that is um, but as of right now my depression has been really hard and it's been hard to get out of bed it's been hard to text my friends back it's been hard to wake up in the morning, go to sleep at night. It's hard to go to work. Even though I need to work, it's hard to work. Because the entire time I'm there, all I can think about is just laying in bed. It's hard. So if things seem back and forth, I'm sorry. That's not really me. I like a plan. I like to be organized. I like to be on top of my stuff. I like to get everything done at once. But right now, I can't. I can't. I forgot I had an appointment at 3 and I just remembered and it's 1.30 so I have time but I need to shower so I guess that is what I'm doing. So I finished my makeup to the best of my ability. Um, I stopped the time lapse halfway through just because I kept getting distracted and um, I just really could not go through with doing my makeup. It was a struggle. It was honestly a struggle to get ready. But, um, it's now like two something, um, my appointment's at three, so I guess I'm just gonna chill until my appointment, and then right after my appointment I'm going to work. So, that will be fun. I'm about to get ready. <coughs> I'm really dreading work tonight. Like, I honestly could cry because I really just 
cannot go to work, but I have to, I need the money, so. I'll show you guys my work uniform in just a second. So I am ready for work. Um, I just cried because I really don't want to go to work. But here's my uniform. It's a black shirt with non-ripped jeans and a belt. And then I normally wear my apron, but not today. Um, but yeah. So I just finished my appointment and now I am about to be on the way to work, sadly, unfortunately, so many words <laughs> that could describe my state of mind because I have to go to work, but yeah, I guess they're going to join me. I am at work and... I don't know if I'm going to be able to film in there or not, but I guess we'll see. You'll see. If not, I'll see you after work. So I'm back. Um, I almost got fired from my job because of everything that was going on yesterday. Um, but I explained to them what had happened and now... I don't work here, kind of. Like, I have a job, but I don't have a job here. <laughs> um. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. So. I am moving tonight. I know. That's crazy. But. I'm moving, and, um, Addie's not going to be in the vlogs. So, it's a new day, um, a lot of stuff happened yesterday, um, I didn't, post last night's video because I moved last night I because of everything that happened um, I moved four hours away and Addie will no longer be in the videos unless she films separately but I guess we'll see come here anyways I think this is gonna be the end of this video um, there's just a lot going on right now and some stuff I just prefer to keep off the internet so yeah I hope you enjoyed I'm sorry this video was a sad one but I want to be real I want you to see what I go through and do on a daily basis so I hope you enjoyed <laughs>